Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to connect iOS device wirelessly and by hardwired. Any iOS devices such as iPad, iPhone, or MacBook that supports AirPlay can be synced wirelessly to LaserBeam Pro by going into the iOS mirroring. First, to connect iOS device to LaserBeam Pro wirelessly, we need a hotspot or high-speed Wi-Fi name and password. I will show you how to connect with my iPad here. So if you click on the hotspot mode, it will ask you to enter hotspot name and password information. But for now, I'll show you how to connect your Wi-Fi. So when I choose the Wi-Fi mode, it will show a pop-up window saying move to the Wi-Fi settings screen. Select OK and then it will jump to the Wi-Fi from the settings menu. Please note that you must go into the same Wi-Fi for both devices from your LaserBeam Pro and from your iOS device. Otherwise, it's not going to be connected. So I'm going to use our company Wi-Fi, which is already connected to the LaserBeam Pro. Now I'm going into the settings from my iPad to connect the same Wi-Fi. And now I need to go back to the main menu and go into the iOS mirroring. And from my iPad, swipe up from the bottle bezel to find AirPlay mirroring. It's right here and when you click it, it shows the pop-up menu with the little Apple TV icon and says C200 ZFIR. Click it. And voila, that's it. It's very easy. You can do the same with your iPhone or MacBook. Now you can play pretty much any content that's downloading on your iOS device or watching video streaming using internet. Please note that streaming copyrighted contents from certain apps such as YouTube, Netflix, and others are blocked on AirPlay. So you can try with the Safari internet browser to go into youtube.com instead of using apps. As you can see, it works that way. You might have some little laggings depending on your Wi-Fi speed and iOS device capacity. But we highly recommend iOS users to be equipped with a set of cables, a micro HDMI cable, and an Apple Lightning AV adapter from the Apple authorized dealer to always have fast and reliable connection and streaming. You can control the volume from the iOS device and the LaserBeam Pro in both ways. If you want better sound quality, you can connect the Bluetooth speaker by connecting any external speaker that supports Bluetooth V4.0 by going into the settings menu from LaserBeam Pro, not from the iOS device. To disconnect, I need to swipe up the bottom bezel from the iPad and select the C200 and select Turn Off Airplay Mirroring. That's it! Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel LaserBeam Pro for more upcoming videos.